You wouldn't think it at first glance by looking at this RC boat, but this has some of the most unique and advanced features that I've ever seen in a little budget-friendly RC boat. And with any luck, we'll have an amazing exclusive RC Sailor coupon code linked in the description box below where you can click this link and pull it up on Amazon and use our coupon code to save a big chunk of money. So be sure to check that out. So we drove halfway across the country <laughs> to be here today to test this boat specifically because it says on the box and on the listing that it can drive on multiple water type surfaces, which means somewhere in between pool, fresh water, and salt water. And we're gonna test it today in the ocean. Yes, we came to the ocean just to test this one well, boat. I think this is technically a river, just so you know. Okay, fair enough. There's <laughs> Water, it is. So uh, the nice thing about this boat is that it comes with two batteries, but check that battery out. I've never seen a battery quite like this on an RC boat. It's also a jet boat, but it is a dual jet boat. And I have never personally had an RC boat that is a dual jet propulsion boat with self riding and with lights. Now this thing locks on the front. We press the side here and look at that. So one motor is going to spin faster than the other to give us our steering. We have a water plug on the bottom of the boat. Again, lights here. And I think we have, that was the auto flip. We can turn our lights on and off. So let's go test this thing and see how it does. Again, we drove all the way to the beach just to test this boat. We're crazy, aren't we? Let's go. We got ourselves a nice, calm day. Looks like it's about to storm too. <laughs> yeah. You ready to do a self riding test? Ready. Okay. Hold on. Let me hold on to my pop socket a little better <laughs> before I okay. drop the. There's actually the a self riding button, so we're going to just test that. It actually works. Oh, oh, it just continues to flip itself. <laughs> I don't know why it's doing that. I'll do it again. Do you have to stop it? Hit it again. Hit it. There. As soon as it's over, what I hit it again. Me? It's really cool. It's like a little torpedo. So let's go. I can toss that in with pretty good confidence. And yeah, we're cruising right around already. Got the birds and pelicans back there. Oh, mm -hmm. How cool is this? We get to test an RC boat with pelicans <laughs> flying in the background. And if it, if I lose signal out there, you guys, just so you know, I am not going out the boat. We're just down a boat or a nice fisherman passing by. There's some people out there deep in the water. So, all right. So this is full throttle, but we do have speed. We have a speed switch on here. So I'm thinking I can actually turn that down to slow it down. So I did just adjust it to slow that down. <laughs> the kid's back there. <laughs> Junior keeps crawling closer. Yeah. But I'm gonna turn that back all the way up. And then we have steering trim. So if our boat's veering off to one direction or the other, a fish, fish are jumping out there in front of my boat. <laughs> oh my gosh, Abby, look at this view. Look at this view. See the bridge out there? See. Some people may know where we are based on that bridge. I know a lot of I you guys. I just saw lightning out there. A lot of you guys are probably wanting me to go out to that pole and around, <laughs> but I'm not doing it. It's actually much farther out than it looks, especially yep. for this little boat. I've just never seen a boat like this. We featured a jet boat on the channel at the beginning of Boat Week, and this one showed up just a little bit too late for Boat Week. So it might fall right after Boat Week. It might actually fall a few videos later. But how cool is this with dual jet propulsion? <laughs> at the ocean right and let's talk about this too guys ask all the time can that boat or any boat run in salt water the answer to all of them is basically yes however if it's not salt water ready like this one claims to be uh oh lightning way out there mm -hmm. that, oh, that's some crazy lightning. lightning it's just heat lightning yeah though. um you need to rinse out your boat and electronics especially in some fresh water so take the hose that one has struck the water out there I missed it. <laughs> let your uh, let your boat get rinsed thoroughly with the hose at the house if you do run it in salt water. So we'll have to do that too, I imagine. But they do claim that this can run in salt water as well. I wouldn't take this in any waves much bigger than this because you guys can see full throttle. We're cruising about as much as we can. But let's test that self-riding one more time. And Abby, you got to give this a shot. Yeah, duh. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Oh, is it my turn? Yes. Okay, where's the button? Uh, back left, I think. Like that one. Mm -hmm. Steering. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. 
Here's another reason why this bow is really good for kids. So this is the props are in there. You just cannot get your fingers. It's kind of scary when you did that actually, Abby. All right, are you ready? We're gonna put you in upside down. And already, you nailed it. Don't beat you. Actually, when you bring it in. Let's see how close we can get to the edge of the water. Yeah, good idea. Now there's some gunky muck up here. And guys, just so you know, we tried to bring our- uh, A dead crab. Nope, there's an alien. We tried to bring, yeah, oh, he's upside down. He's upside down, he's not, not doing alien. so good. Yeah, he's actually moving. You know, he might be okay. Yeah, he's missing a leg. Uh, how close? Oh, you beached it. Nope. It kept going after, I, I don't know. Yeah. I was distracted, maybe that was me. You want to try to avoid driving in much stuff like that as often as you can, because if you suck a ton of that in there, you're going to have to clean it out. Oh, All right. I see why I'm struggling. It has power when you turn. Oh, wow, that's crazy. You How flipped did I it just over. do that? Well, with the help of the wave. And then... so. Nice. Right, yeah, it does have power when you turn. That'd be famous bow nuts, but at the beach. There we go. That like never happened. That'd be famous bow nuts. I know, lightning, lightning was out there. It, I did because I was zoomed in on the bow nuts. So this is a great pool boat. It's a great kid safe boat. It's extremely well rounded, has two batteries. It comes with a USB charger. And again, with any luck, we'll have our coupon code for you guys to save some money. I love that it has lights too. This boat for the money just does a lot that other boats don't do. And as soon as we're done here, it's out, this lightning keeps hitting. Amelia's gonna drive the boat. So that'll be really cool for us to do just as a family. Look at these beautiful white birds. No, a boat video, I forgot, sorry. <laughs> We're here at the beach, hope you guys don't mind a couple beachy things in the video. All right, Abby, full throttle. Oh, yeah, maybe they saw it, maybe. Full throttle, hit the beach as hard as you can. Okay. See how high up on the sand you can get it. Yeah, hopefully some of that's showing up. And we'll do the water test. Okay, that's, that's good. <laughs> Pass it off to you. Water test. You do get water in here. There's a plug. You just pull that plug and the water will drain. And the interesting thing is as soon as we disconnect this battery, it is off. So power goes off. Mm -hmm. And I'm guessing, does the radio beep when that happened? Nothing. Ah, so that means we have telemetry. So if our battery would get low, it'll let us know. You guys check it out in here. It is bone dry below that battery and that's what we want to see. So I just thought that was a really cool boat. I did not expect this to be as unique as it is. Uh, and when I opened it up and I started taking a closer look at it, I realized there's a lot of different things about this boat that I generally don't see. Dual jet propulsion, self-riding, that's very awesome. It'll be linked in the description box below if you guys wanna support our channel and our family. A little bit of gas money to help us get here just by clicking the link and pulling it up and buying something while you're there helps us a ton. I wanna say a massive thanks to God for getting us here safe, safely to share this experience with you guys. What a beautiful opportunity this has been. We came here to see the sunset, by the way. Yeah, <laughs> it should be there. setting right over there. Yeah, we came here to film this video. Well. <laughs> Hoping I picked this beach, but it actually worked out well. I forgot how there's no waves right here. I can't believe how far Daniel has made it. Yeah. His tracks look like a tortoise. Also, a massive thanks to our Patreon supporters because we couldn't do what we do as often or as distant as we do it without your amazing support. We thank you guys from the bottom of our hearts. If you want to see more RC boat fun in action, we'll have a special video handpicked just for you popping up right about now. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there. Bye.